Back straight, back straight, back straight. No, that's leaning backwards. Back straight. Make believe you're a marionette. May I touch your hand? Make believe you're a marionette and somebody's pulling you off from up here. All right? But don't bend the knees up. This hump, what we call it, might just be a hump of that, we call it. It makes life easier. All right? So, so. That's how we work it. Jim, so, so. Very important when I go like this, and you don't your voice. So you can develop a, a what do you call what they used to call a one inch punch by just throwing your arm out like this. You have to focus in different areas of the body. So each punch that you do, no matter, it's like four times the time it gets out here. So it's four different punches. You should focus on four different occasions. Okay. Now, now this is how I was taught this Joe did that punch. That's what we're talking about. You see this rotation? I was taught that way too. Right. Doesn't work. That's what I you know what our guy can do. That's us when we're over there. That is hard. You want to know what doesn't work? That's tradition. Let's talk about orthodox. All right? I'm a read. There he is. You want the wars over there? In the car, the Joe Ponds, I mean, went like this, all right? Don't make me go this so. way. What are you doing, guys? It won't work. Waste of time. The technique is not out, it's in and then out. What you're concentrating on is this part of the body. So, when, in other words, if you were making a grab, come make one of them. I pinpoint them here and then open them. I can't do this. If I just did this, it breaks my nose. So when he comes in, attack. Once he's weak here, then you can expand and create open. So when you do that, when you do the kata, it's here and then open. Understand? You don't do things that don't work. Things that work. One of the most basic things in martial arts is contraction and expansion. You have to, if you don't have that, you don't have anything. Now, some parts are more important than others. Expansion is more important than contraction, but you have to have one. If you can't expand, you don't have contraction. So you, each move must have an expansion and contraction. Otherwise, the technique will not work. So, cross. Crossing is a very dangerous thing. This is a trap. What you do is you begin to go and you cross here. That is a trap. That's what they teach most people. You should be orthodox. If you cross, you trap. What we do is expand. That's always expansion. Crossing only comes on sometimes. Where I work, in other words, my my own guy would be like cutting in, but not like this. You keep it this way. You don't cross. That's the difference between traditional and orthodox. That's what you need for we call top row. All right, that is fine. But that is only to rub the sensibility. And not your, because you constantly rub the whole thing, you not put the nerve in. We rub to let you know that we're not doing it to me, I'm doing it to you. The rubbing means I'll have a partner. That's why we do it if I had a partner. You understand what I'm saying? Because we have all these rubbing exercises, you know, down the condition, that kills the nerve. Right. Once you're here, and you finish the technique, right? You're stepping. Step, then in and out. Step first. Don't do it together. It's too much to chew. Step first, get the foundation, and then do the technique. 